There are so many icons now in new cars. It might seem like you need a map just to read them all there on the dash. But not on your side. Consumer reporter John Matteris breaks down which ones you really need to know so you don't waste your money. Today's cars have all sorts of digital displays that tell you if your tire is getting low or if it's almost time for an oil change. And that's nice to know. But there are three warning lights that require immediate attention. And if you ignore them, you could be stranded. So you're driving along and all of a sudden a bell chimes. You look down and see your engine lights on. What should you do? AAA says there are two lights you should never ignore. One is the overheating light. It's a red thermometer and it means your motor is low on coolant and is overheating. Two is the red oil can light. This means your oil is low and your engine could seize up if you don't do anything. In both cases, pull off the road as soon as it's safe. Do not keep driving. But from the dozen that stink file, lights that just confuse you, like the infamous check engine light. It can mean your emissions controls are having a problem, your gas cap is open, you need service, or Aunt Marge baked an apple pie. If it leads you to panic, you'll say, doesn't that stink? With the check engine light, don't worry. You can keep driving. Just have a shop check your engine soon. So make sure everyone in your family knows which warning lights are just a reminder and which could destroy your car's engines. You don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris, nine on your side.